We're going to use form to make this bouncing box animation. When you tap the box, it'll grow to 1.5 scaling. And we're going to take a look at how to make this. We're going to just start fresh. We're going to delete all those patches. And now we're going to start by adding a color view. And by default, it'll add this white box. And we can change the size on it. So we're just going to do 100 pixels. And now we want to center this on the screen. So we're going to use the align layout patch. And here we'll connect the layout patch to the color view. So we're going to do all the X, Y, Z position and all of the anchors. And you're going to see once it's connected, it doesn't move to the center of the screen. And what we need to do is go into the align layout patch and set the X position and Y position to center. And now we're ready to add the interaction. So we'll start by adding this touch interaction patch. And then we want a spring transition. So we're going to add a spring patch and a transition patch. And we'll connect the down interaction to the Z rest on the spring patch. And then we're going to connect the Z position to the input on the transition patch. And then we're going to connect the transition output to the scale input on the color view. And you're going to see it just disappears. And that's because on the transition patch, we have the min set to 0 and the max set to 1. But we want the min to be the full size. And so that's 1. And then when we tap, we want it to grow. So we set it to 1.5. So now the, tr the color view will transition from scale 1 to scale 1.5. And that creates this bounce animation.